So I worked in Maasai Mara National Reserve in Kenya, which is right on the border with Tanzania. And so between Maasai Mara and Serengeti, we have an area of about 25,000 square kilometers. And it's one of the few places in the world where migratory ungulates have actually been protected. So you have uh, migratory wildebeest and zebra that move between the two parks every year. And that turns out to be a really critical resource for, for scavengers, especially for really um, highly mobile scavengers like vultures. Across all of Kenya, there's eight different vulture species. In Maasai Mara, you get six of those. And then you also have other scavenging raptors like batalures, tawny eagles, marabou storks, um, and then even hyenas and jackals. So it's really a very diverse, um, rich scavenging guild, and it's probably one of the most diverse scavenging guilds anywhere in the world. So while I was doing my master's, vultures were declining rapidly in uh, Asia and I started to get interested in vultures sort of as a whole group because of that and started asking people, well, what's happening to vultures in Africa and, and in East Africa in particular where I'd been working? And nobody seemed to know, so that seemed pretty indicative that maybe it was time to start paying attention to this important, although not particularly attractive, group of birds. Hyenas and, and even feral dogs and jackals eat a lot of carrion, but vultures eat about 70% of all the available meat in the Mara Serengeti system. And part of the reason they're able to do that is because they're social, because they, they find things early and they eat them fast. Vultures are out there eating all the, the rotten meat um, that would otherwise be left to, to other things. It's, it's not that there wouldn't be something to eat it, but it would potentially be things like flies and bacteria. And those are species that spread disease rather than control it. And so vultures are helping to get rid of the meat, um, to get rid of disease and to keep it out of the system. One of the Maasai that we interviewed actually said this best. And, he said vultures are the soap of the savanna.